Hey guys, hey y'all. Okay guys, so I know I have not been around in a while guys, but I have had a lot going on, you know, things, you know how life goes, okay? All right. So anyways, um, today is beautiful. The weather is very beautiful and lately the weather has been beautiful even the light little thunderstorms i've been starting to like light thunderstorms now guys i'm not as fearful of the light thunderstorms as i used to be okay so now if it's a big one i'm still very afraid okay just as long as it's like a light one now and i find it to be very relaxing a little bit okay all right but um <clears throat> i hope everybody's doing good doing great and everything is going your way you are blocking out the haters blocking out the negativity bringing in some positivity in your life and that's the only thing you're letting in your life and i hope that while you're transforming yourself to be who you want to be you're still loving yourself and just transforming higher and higher and higher Okay, if not, here are some vibes for you to love yourself, embrace who you are, transform into that amazing person with all that positiveness, okay? Alright, guys. <clears throat> it's always that I'm going to have throat problems every time I get on and start talking, okay? Alright, so here is my hair for today, guys. Just decided to try a different little style. It is just basically kind of curly or maybe wavy on this side and then I have a braid on this side loosen on the ends and a little wavy curly okay so anyways and guys can I just say that I love my earrings okay I just love them okay and I have gotten some more also guys okay so anyways I'll show you that probably in another video okay all right so anyway Today, the video is going to be about, oh my god, <laughs> I don't even know, I forgot, I might have to get up and look at my tablet, oh, um, today the video is just basically going to be about loving who you are, you know, not really loving who you are, you know, because you have to love who you are. But maybe that'll be a later video. But this video right here is going to be about you are who you say you are. Okay, guys, I need to get it together because like I told you, it's things that are just happening and stuff. And then I'm trying to get my mind straight, keep my mind right and things like that. Okay, I usually have my notes around me, but unfortunately, I have them over there. But anyway, okay, and I really didn't have any notes for this video. I just wanted to talk about this. You are who you say you are. Okay, because, you know, like, incidents like this have been popping up for so long. Like, it just keeps popping up around me, you know, and I just want to scream and tell people that you are who you say you are. Okay, like, for example, all right, when you know how, like, you, you might have could have been a different person back in the day, you know, like, way, way back in the day. And that's how some people know you to be, right? They claim they know you to be that way. All right, but you really never know a person, you know. Like, no, 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 a person, because a person can change in like a second. Like, I know for myself, I can tell you something today at 502 and 503, I might be telling you something different if I think about it, you know. But that's you. It's all about what you want to be and how you want to be, you know. That's your own personal thing. Any Nobody has anything to do with your identity or your reputation that you're trying to put out in the world or whatever. You know, your characteristics are you are who you make yourself to be, okay? You could be nice, then you could be mean. If you want to be, you could be a nice person and then something could happen and you just want to change to be a mean person, okay or you want to be a mean person you you're a mean person and you just want to change to be a nice person it's all up to you so in the world you are who you say you are but some of my main reasons for wanting to talk about this is because in the world one thing that i have found out and see when people want to transform themselves to be 
different because I don't know, like you don't know and I don't know what is going on in their life that makes them feel like they want to transform. Like sometimes it's really boring probably to stay the same, but not really, you know, not really. Just scratch that. Maybe if you stay the same, it's okay. It's up to you. Whatever. But if you want to change and you want to be a completely different person and you want to go around and you want to behave like that, okay, because that's what you have to do. You want to transform, right? You want to bring it alive. You go around and there's going to be a difference <clears throat> that people see. Now, everybody is not going to be so happy or so congratulating or so supportive of this new behavior that you choose to want to go around and be all of a sudden. So they're going to be surrounding you with questions like, oh, I didn't know you were like that. I didn't know you like that. I didn't know you do things like that. I didn't know that's who you are for the most part. And then the other side would be, I don't. When, well, since when did you get like that? Well, since when did you start thinking like that? Well, when did this come about? Who is this? Who am I talking to? You know, I don't know you and things like that. I mean, those are normal questions if somebody knows you to be something. But just please, just try to embrace the fact that everybody is not going to stay the same all the time. Like, we have different journeys, different roads, different paths in life that we're going to all go down. And depends on our experiences while we're having those long paths and those long journeys and all this stuff is happening to us. Well, that is what is transforming us to be different and change us to be a completely different person, okay? And it's really, that's healthy in the world to you know, you might have an experience and you just want to change. You might find out something didn't work for you and you probably want to do something else, guys. You know, try a different way, learn something different, have a different behavior. But always remember while you're doing that to always be you, okay? And look, even if you don't want to be you, that's your problem, okay? Whatever floats your boat and get you through this life and keep you surviving, okay? that's up to you nobody else has anything else to do with that so you know when people come around and be like oh you're acting like this well I didn't know like five years ago I remember when this happened and you did this about it but now you're saying you'll do this you know if you want to address it address it if you don't then don't because a lot of people want to take you back on memory lane and I mean I don't think that's good but you know of course if you change people are going to have questions but a lot of them want to take you back in the place that you were. I don't know. Maybe they missed that. Um, and that's sad if they do. But, you know, you live your life for you and you have to be who you want to be. You know, those experiences have changed you to be who you want to be. All right. And that's one thing in the world that you have to do is live your life for you. Nobody else can live that life but you. Nobody goes through those experiences unless they were with you but you. And even if they did go through the experiences with you and they were there and experienced the same thing, it's going to come out in totally different reactions unless you guys agree and be like, well, I'm going to start being like this. I'm going to start doing this different. I'm going to start saying this, you know, it, then fine. But most of the time, it could affect you in a different way than it affects somebody else, even if they were there, okay? But, guys, that's just something that I get tired of. You know, like, depending on how long you live, do you think you're going to stay the same person? You're not. Okay? Because when you were a kid, you were all joyful. Well, for the most of us, you know, you you were all joy, joyful, not really worrying about anything. Sometimes a bad event could happen. And as a kid, you would probably still... In 10 minutes after you hear about it, or less, 10 minutes or less, you would go outside and want to play and have fun. And then somebody probably would have to remind you that this is what happened. You know, this terrible thing happened and stuff like that. And even if it wasn't, guys, okay? It's just you want to be a different, you want to be a different person. Not a different person. You want to be who you are, but you just want to make a difference in your life, okay? So get it where it can fit in for you, okay? Like, for me, like, with a lot of experiences that I've had in my life, a lot of roles that I've been down and paths that I've taken, and 
I've had all kind of emotions about it and stuff, you know. And then I say to myself, I'm tired of feeling this way about these things. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to change this. And people, you know, people are going to notice a difference in my behavior because why because i don't want to feel these certain ways it's just basically like blocking certain things out okay so i can live a better life you know that's why most people do it so they can live a better life but anyways for the people that come along and stuff and try to make you feel down about how you choose to be or how you used to be you know don't let them take you back to that place because I'm sure you already think about it in your mind anyways, but you could be whoever you want to be. You can be however you want to be, okay? You Look, I'm not promoting you to be a bad person, but if you want to be a bad person, it's up to you. That's your life. That's what you choose to do. You are the only person that are going to have to pay for those consequences for being a bad person, okay? You could be a good person. You can be... A sweetheart all of a sudden you know whatever okay your life is yours and God's but you know you could be you can do anything okay you can be anything let's just hope it's not too terrible but if you do like I said that's your choice and who has say so if you're an adult basically okay who has say so nobody Nobody you know, like your family can't come along and tell you how to be. Your friends can't come along and tell you how to be. Even your mate can not come along and tell you how to be, okay? Because if you want something else like that, you go out and you seek that. That's to all of them, okay? Family, friends, mates, whatever. Now, when the questions and stuff start coming along, don't change yourself to be like you used to be. Don't let it discourage you into the making of what you want to make of yourself. You be who you want to be, okay? Whatever fits for you. Yeah, it's going to look strange to people. It's going to come off a little funny, but at first, but guess what? The ones and stuff that stick around, they'll get with it. <laughs> and if they don't, then you continue to go on. That means those weren't meant to come down that journey with you, okay? And then the next thing is, if you do decide to transform yourself and change and this, make yourself be who you want to be, if people have so much to say, if people don't agree, who cares? Okay? Like, who cares? Soon, next week, you might be talking to them this week, and next week, they might be a different person. And then it's going to go around in the world. That's what people don't understand. Things tend to go around in the world. Whatever you're going through later, the people that know you, they're going to come and tell you this like two years, five years later, okay? And then when you were telling them, they didn't understand. So that's another important reason why not to worry about what people are really saying about you because soon they're going to be on that level too. Maybe different experiences, but they're going to be on that level. So don't let anybody tell you who you are. Or don't let anybody stop you from being who you are trying to make yourself to be. It's for you. It's your survival mode, okay? Nobody's going to survive for you. You have to survive for yourself. So, in that case, you can go around and have a different personality. You can have a different voice if you want. <laughs> and yes, I know that might be funny, but still, you can have a different voice. You can have a different attitude. You can have a different anything. You can do anything to make yourself better, okay? If they don't get it, don't get it, okay? It's not for everybody to get. Whatever you do is for you only to get. And I wouldn't advise you to go around and treat people, start, you know, start going around and treat people bad. Maybe put out some more limits and stuff to your life. And, you know, things, stop some things from happening and... Just whatever you feel is best for you. Okay, guys. That's it. That's all. If I would like to come and say more, I will probably make another video about that a little later. Alright. So, take care and love yourself. Embrace yourself. And don't let anybody tell you who you want to be. 
I'm so sorry guys that was my son coming back from the store <laughs> so okay <laughs>